Good morning, everyone. We got a package, and it's for me. So I'm going to open it. We just had to make a mad dash to the to the post office to mail a package. Yeah. <laughs> you want to open it? He's smelling. I cannot open this. There's a little tab. See here. Oh tab yeah. Here. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Boo, you're showing your bad side where we cut your fur. <gasps> Mine? What's that? We'll find out. Keep going. Somebody's watching. Boo, you're so majestic. <laughs> you're so majestic in the sunlight. She's like, watch her. I can't open it. That is so cute. Ooh. Iowa. <gasps> Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Another Oklahoma <gasps> and South Dakota and North Dakota. And oh, it's in North Dakota. My North. Hold on, I'm going to grab your poster. It's right there. Okay. Okay. This is my collection of postcards. We have to add these to them. And once this gets full, we're going to start another one. I speak. Okay, I'm going to read the card. Yes, I hope you like this card. The little girl reminded me of you. My husband and I just did a road trip from Sugar Land, Texas to... can go and look on the map and you can see how far it is, how far she went. It probably took a day. <laughs> probably longer than a day. Because you know what takes us how long to get to Michigan. 13 hours. Almost 16 hours. <gasps> Oklahoma. We saw people that were doing a yard sale and they had phone finger things on and they were pointing to the yard sale which kind of looks like. Well you know what it looks like. What? Looks like a pot. <laughs> How? A pot if it was straight across right here. <laughs> it's a pot you make your oatmeal in in Oklahoma. <laughs> Maybe someone took a big bite out of your pot. Ooh, Iowa. Is that a pig on there? Looks like it. Uh, there's Iowa. And South Dakota. Oh, look at the park. We need to put these on our fridge. Okay. Let's go stick them on there. Thank you so much. I love, I love the magnets. And I love the card, it's super cute. And I love the postcards. Thank you so much. You wanna go look on the map? Yeah. So here's our map. And where is she from? Um, she was from Houston, wasn't she? Sugarland. Yeah, is, Sugarland. Which we looked up and is somewhere over here. Somewhere, <laughs> we don't really know. And they traveled from here all the way to so how many states did they go through? Five. 
Do you think that's a long trip? Do you think that's like, Almost well, that's, that's longer than from when we are here. So we have to go all the way. way. We, we have to go he, here, 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 here. Yep, we go through North Carolina, Tennessee, Kentucky, Ohio, and Michigan. Where does Grandma live in Michigan? Um, I don't know. Right about where that H is. Right here? Yep, so we gotta go all the way up <laughs> through Michigan. Okay. Huh. Hey, that's me. Do I have to cut P.O. box or something? Yep. Huh? Yep. Mano. Look what she got. Mano. What is that? What does it say? Mano. Mano. What does that mean? It's in uh, North South Dakota. South Dakota, Iowa, Texas, Oklahoma. Well, that was from... It's in North Dakota. It's in North Dakota. It's in North Dakota. Mom can do a trick. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, guys. It's now like 4.11. And you looked at the clock on the van. Yeah, I looked at the clock on the van. We we're finally leaving the house. I took a nice long nap because I didn't feel very well. I was having like leg pains. They're calf pains. That's what I was having. Calf pains. I don't know why. Maybe I had uh, cramps during the night, like cramps. And, I don't know. But it, it feels better now. But we were talking about wrist watches. <laughs> wrist watches. <laughs> wrist watches. And I wondered, I wondered if the wristwatch sales have gone down since cell phones have taken over. They had a kid with them, like a two-year-old, and they stuck them in the front seat without no car seat. Uh, a lot of people probably do that. I, I mean, they, some people get away with it, but if you had an accident... How would you ever forgive yourself if yeah, something happened to your child? Right. Anyway. Because you didn't have them strapped in right or whatever. Anyway. You talking about watches? Yeah, go on. So we're going to see how oh, many... Oh, yeah, we were going to count how, how many, many people, people we see today that wear a wristwatch. Because we were wondering, since everybody's got a pocket watch, which would be your cell phone, if, if people actually... Because we don't wear wristwatches. We did probably when we first met, but... But I used to wear them right up until I quit work. Oh, I thought you was going to say you wore them until you met me and time just totally stopped. <laughs> anyway. No, I used to wear them at work. Yeah, but I wanted to know what time I was getting off work. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to count the number of people that wear the wristwatch today. And we're going to eat barbecue. We made it. <laughs> Hey guys, we are home. We've been home for a little while. It is, I don't even know what time it is, but um, after we ate barbecue, which you probably saw, we just came home and my husband had to go back to work. So um, he works at a church and there was a wedding today, so he had to go um, clean up after it. Fun stuff, but I'm in Sterling's room right now, Sterling Journey's room, and, oh, funny thing, not funny, but when we were heading to go eat barbecue, like there was, we turned to this road, and that road, the, with the road we were turning onto, you know, there was like a car, another car, and there's a stop sign there, so they were stopped, and then another car, but that car like totally went into our lane like we totally had to swerve and drive in the grass like not on the road anymore to avoid hitting this car it was quite quite freaky my husband's just like oh my god <laughs> it's one of those ones where it just totally stops your heart because like we're dry like okay with like here we are we're on this road and we go to turn right and as we turn that car just like comes into our lane and we had to drive off the side of the road craziness and after all the 
things I went through yesterday and almost hitting a deer and I was just like, oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway, so aside for that, um, we come home and I just haven't been feeling that great today. Not like I'm not feeling sick. I'm just like, um, I think she's getting bigger and she weighs a lot more now and I just feel really pregnant and like my pelvic bone is hurting. Um, I remember this with all the other kids as well. It just feels like there's a lot of pressure, like a lot of weight on it and it doesn't help that she is breech. I know she breathes. All her kicks are really low. You know, I can't breathe. Her head's like somewhere up here. It's all hard. So, but I'm like, yeah, I'm miserable, uncomfortable, whatever, but I'm just, I'm happy that she's in there. Um, and I've been having, like, I don't know, just like pregnancy emotions, I guess, going on. <laughs> because, okay, we went to the P.O. box this morning, as you guys probably know, and we got... A couple things one well actually two I know are off our registry and then Sterling got the postcards and stuff which she was really excited to receive those and she's going to fill up her poster board this is it she's actually got a couple more that we have to put in there and then she said she wants to do another one of these and so yeah so when you send her a postcard that's where they go <laughs> But there's like um, some that Claire sent us from Paris, Disneyland. But actually that's on our refrigerator right now. So um, anyway, but we did receive this in the mail. Like we got there right when, okay, our post office is only open for one hour on Saturdays from 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. So I wanted to package up this order and get it there and we got there at probably 9.58 but they were already closing the gate or whatever and so Sterling was able to give them the package that we were mailing out so they know us there at the post office anyway. But she, and then she's like, we checked the P.O. box and we had one of those big yellow slips that says your item's too big and we heard her she's like, you guys got a big package back here? So I was like, okay. So she ended up handing us, you know, giving us this through the door and uh, I'll show you what it is in just a moment oh my gosh okay, okay, okay are you ready are you ready for this are you ready somebody bought us a car seat and it's the one I wanted oh my gosh okay oh my gosh okay okay okay, okay. so of course I got all emotional when I saw this right I'm still not quite sure who it's from, but I've been trying not to. Is that a bug? Is that a bug? Is that a bug right there? I don't know. I've been trying not to look at the registry because it'll tell you, um, like, when something's been purchased or whatever. So just to kind of keep it like surprisey, I've been trying not to look, but um, I don't. Does it? Say? No. No. Usually it has a little note in here, but I know on the registry, like I can go and it'll show you items that have been purchased and it'll tell you who purchased it. So when I find out, you know. But anyway, so this was sitting in the um kitchen and this is right before we went to go eat barbecue. And I was like, I just want to open it up. I was like, well, I was like, I want to open it up. So I opened it in. And just, just, oh my goodness, I can't look at it. <laughs> I just can't look at it. Oh my goodness. Okay, just like looking in the box, it just, oh my gosh. Okay, you ready? We're all going to look together. Can you guys see that? I think there is a tag down there, maybe. Oh, it just made me all emotional. It's just like, I don't know. 
Like that's her car seat. That's what she's gonna be sitting in. That's what she's gonna be riding in. That's what she's gonna be coming home from the hospital in. And I absolutely love, 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 love the colors. I love them. Let's pull it out, shall we? Anyway, guys, that is her car seat. Oh my gosh, isn't it beautiful? I absolutely love the colors. Can you see the colors? I've been going with a lot of pink and gray. Um, not that it's like her theme or anything. Um, because we really don't have a theme. This is, she's going to be sharing a room with Sterly, but a lot of her things are pink and gray. And, um, a lot of things are giraffes, of course, since Sterly loves giraffes, but. Oh my goodness. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Whoever bought this for us, I'm going to find out because I can look on the registry, but I've been trying to refrain from looking at that just so that it can kind of be a surprise. And we are trying to think of a date for like the online shower where we open everything. Um, I'm thinking towards the end of August, like maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to look at the calendar. I mean, you know, that that will just be the date we set that we'll open stuff. So, and oh my gosh, besides this, which we already knew, and the bassinet, which you guys saw like a couple blogs ago, because obviously we knew what it was because of the box. <laughs> oh my gosh, it just makes it so much real, so much more real. You know what I mean? It's like. This is what we waited for. This is what we wanted. A little baby to go in the seat. <laughs> Thanks so, so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. See you tomorrow. <laughs>